this is Stampy, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Skylanders Trap Team. As promised in the last episode, I am continuing uh, to play as Kaboom. And the reason I'm playing as him for uh, two episodes in a row is because he is awesome, and he can do this, and he can do this, and he can do uh, this as well. So yeah, he's a... Uh, He's pretty powerful, to, to say the least, and I just bought uh, a bunch of uh, new moves for him, and I'm looking forward to, to putting them to the test. Uh, but I did say a lie in the last episode, where I said that I am probably going to go to the, uh, the Golden Desert, but I am not. And the reason I'm not is because I am doing something I have never done before. I have got myself some magical items, and I'm going to place them on my portal now and see what happens. I have just put down the mirror of mystery. Ooh. Let's see what happens. What is this mysterious mirror? Greetings, foolish portal master. I am Evalon, and you have gazed into the mirror of mystery. Soon, I will be putting an end to your wretchedly good and magical skylands. That is, Unless you are brave enough to step through the mirror and confront me. <laughs> um, um, I a little bit, um, regret putting down the mirror. Maybe I shouldn't have put down the mirror, uh, because now I put down the mirror, bad things are happening. <laughs> right, what is this then? Uh, you can go to this level using the chapter select menu. Do you want to leave the current adventure and travel there? Yeah, let's, uh, let's travel. Let's go inside the mirror and uh, face that evil fella, who I can't remember his name already. <laughs> the mirror of mystery then. It looks like there's a, a chompy that we can capture and another weird looking thing. And I guess this is it. Is this the, the other side of the mirror? Oh, wow. We made it. We actually made it. Oh, there you are, Gladshanks. Say, you're looking marvelous today. And who's this fine fellow you're with? Uh, Lord Chaos? Is... Is that really you? Why, of course it's me, old buddy, old pal. Our classic Gladshanks. Always a laugh riot. Ah, just what I thought. We've traveled to a mirror universe. Everything is opposite here. Eon is actually called Evilon and is a dark portal master. And Lord Chaos is, uh, um, nice. Unfortunately, I do bring bad news, I'm afraid. It appears that dreadful Mabu Offense Force is planning to attack this happy little troll village. Naturally, I'd offer to defend it myself, but you know me, team player, and completely non-violent. <laughs> well, things are, are certainly different here. Do you reckon if I pick up these coins, I'm going to lose money rather than getting money? And oh, look, is, that a, is there a big fish in there? Look at the size of that fish! Oh, he looks happy! He's a happy fish! <laughs> Let's go and speak to now suddenly genuinely nice chaos then, shall we? Quest discovered. Uh, fishness protection program. Oh, my poor innocent fish friend. As much as I hate to raise my voice, I need to scare him away from this pond before the village gets attacked! If only Mablobs were here, he'd scare my little fishy friends for me. Mab lobs. <laughs> right, uh, judging by the, uh, the picture, uh, that is the, uh, the villain uh, that we're going to be capturing, uh, hopefully, uh, inside of this, um, inside of this, um, yeah, this little pack. So I guess all of these trolls, uh, even though they're, they're normally evil, uh, I guess they're all suddenly nice now. And well, actually, while we're here, I did also get some, some other items. I got, um, I got a rocket ram, and I don't know what a rocket ram is. I'm just gonna place it on the portal and just see if anything happens. Uh, there are too many magic items on the Traptanium portal. Oh, okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'll take it off. All right, I guess we're doing one magical item at a time then. <laughs> I just wanted to, to see what happened. All hey, uh, right then, what are we supposed brother to do? Troll, are you and your big friend here for the peace rally? Same thing here. In this world, it's the trolls who are happy and peaceful while Mabu are the mean invaders. I know, crazy, isn't it? Um, no, uh, but we heard your village was about to be attacked and want to uh, help. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that would be cool, too. Hey, there might be some old mech slaying around this town. Why don't you see if you can get them up and running? Sounds good. Thanks, I guess. Right, let's uh, see if we can get some, some mechs Skylander? running, shall we? I'm going to go explore the town a little. I've got to say, I'm really beginning to like this place. <laughs> Me too, Glumshanks. I like it. 
Why can't the trolls always be nice? But then I guess the Mabu are going to be evil. So I guess no matter what, we are still getting our, uh, our evil villains. I know I saw one over here in Uncle Ziggy's garage. Okay, let's go and uh, uh, head to the uh, the garage then and let's see uh, if we're going to be able to, to make ourselves a, a mech. I can go and uh, break open some of these barrels, I think, uh, to get a, a bit more money and I might be able to, to upgrade Kaboom uh, even uh, further if I'm lucky. Uh, I only probably just about uh, fit through this area, to be honest. Right, let's say we've got a, a bit of a puzzle. Uh, I got zero out of three of these things, which makes me think that i got to get three of them. But first, I need to move these blocks out of the way uh, so I can actually uh, get to it. There we go. Uh, I've now got one of them. And so are these the uh, these the mechs then? There also seems to be a way uh, how I could get uh, through to the, the back there. But I'm not sure. Because if I slide this one... Uh, actually, can I go this way at all? Can I jump through the, uh, the cogs? No, I don't seem to be able to. I don't know how I'd get to the uh, the other side. I don't know if I needed to have, um, uh, move the uh, the blocks in a, a different order. Anyway, let's go and head out uh, to the other side and uh, back uh, into the uh, into the troll village. Then, shall we? Uh, I reckon there's probably going to be a um, uh, another mech inside of uh, here. Uh, oh no! Oh, looks like we can uh, place some some sky stones in here. Uh, first, let me do my normal thing and uh, destroy absolutely everything. <laughs> I want to fight some things. I'm so ridiculously powerful. I just want to get into to some fights. But first, hey, I can man, never say no to a, a game of sky stones. Business. And let's play some sky stone smash instead. You dig? It's funny because the trolls just sound like they got all of the uh, the same voices as the uh, the Mabu did. Groovy, man. Uh, let's let's go and actually pick our stones then, shall we? Uh, are any of the ones up here uh, any better than the ones down there? I don't seem to be able to scroll through. Right, are any of these looking underpowered? This guy only um has one heart, and uh, I know he does that fireball attack. Uh, but let's go and have a, a look through and see if there's anyone uh, that would be a little bit tougher than he is. Uh, I think all of the uh the main special villains, the Doom Raiders, are the best ones to have. Uh, so yeah, it looks like he might be better than all of the others anyway. So yeah, let's go with what they suggested and to see if we can win a game. It uh, looks like the uh, the opposing troll has a uh, 14 hearts for me to, to get rid of. And Cruiser. I think I had some, some quite good ones to start with. These are all ones with quite a lot of health, uh, so they should be able to all survive uh, this first attack. Yeah, that one only does two damage. So let's go and I uh, might as well put down my weakest one uh, for now, and uh, which is probably this one. I uh, think it's my weakest one, uh, but he's still strong enough uh, to be able to survive his attack and uh, take uh, him out uh, in the uh, the process as well. So already a uh, good start. I think the strategy, uh, strategy is to always just have more uh, characters on the, uh, the play field uh, than they do. And so because of that, uh, I think now I'm actually going to be able to win this fight as well. And you can see that I will then have uh, two cards on the uh, the play field and they won't have any. So even, even though they put one down now, uh, if I can take that one out as well, uh, I should be uh, in a good uh, position to, to win this. So um, let's just do someone who does lots of damage. There we go. This guy uh, does four damage. And uh, because they don't have a card on the other side, uh, I should be able to do absolutely loads of damage. In fact, uh, they're only going to have four hearts left after this already. I'm just too good. I'm just, I just shouldn't be allowed to play this game. I'm just way sheep too creep. good at playing Sky Stars. Much. And they put down a Sheep Creep. Is this literally opposite day to where, like, Wolf the enemies game. that would normally do well are like, just suddenly ball. really rubbish now? <laughs> because I've won. Look at this. I've won already. I defeated Strawberry. Strawberry the Troll. <laughs> and I got a whole load of money for doing it. And I didn't feel like I deserved that money. It was so easy. Oh, I can dig it, man. It's not all about who lost and who won. It's about togetherness, right? <laughs> So you should probably give me a rematch. <laughs> oh, I bet he wouldn't have said that if he won. And please look me in the, the eyes when talking to me. He was just staring at my knees while he spoke to me. Right. I got a, uh, a present here and you all know what that means. It means it's time to... Bash, 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 what hat is this? A carnival hat. Aha. I think this is going to put his uh, speed up a little bit. So I actually I want to make cool. sure I uh, I want a hat that is going to put his speed up as Set much as possible side. because he moves uh, so ridiculously slowly. Uh, I want to get uh, the hat that's going to make him go as fast because I think he's uh, strong enough uh, in all uh, other areas. So if I just get one that makes him go really, really fast, uh, then I think he's going to be really powerful. So let's just scroll through. And uh, the only thing I'm really looking at is one that's going to put uh, his speed up as much as possible. So the one I've got on uh, puts his speed up by four. Uh, so I want one uh, that's going to do it even more. I think it's the, the lightning bolt that's the uh, the speed, I think. And that shower cap did six. 
Can we have anything, any any raises on six? Anything uh, above six? If not, I'll go back and put that one on. Any more above six? These are all giving loads of defense and things, uh, but because he's so strong at that, uh, it doesn't really matter anymore. That's plus two speed. Uh, I don't think the uh, the turtle hat's going to help. Right, it looks like he's about to wear the shower cap then. <laughs> it will also look hilarious as well, so that's another good thing. Oh, actually, I wonder if any of these, um, these trinkets are going to put his speed up at all. I think the trinkets are really only make them look different, to be honest. They don't actually make them more powerful. But there we go. He can have a, a pretty bow on his wrist as well. There we go. Oh, he likes it. You can hear how happy he is. <laughs> and he looks absolutely ridiculous. I think it's made a difference, though. Uh, that has actually made him uh, walk a little bit faster. He's still uh, on the uh, the sluggish side as far as the um, uh, the Skylanders go, but it has made him uh, a little bit faster uh, than where he was before. And oh, what's, what's going on with all these acorns then? Am I going to be uh, planting them, maybe? Oh, a quest discovered. Aha! This is the uh, the quest uh, where I need the um, uh, the other villain, which I'm going to get while I'm here. Now, can I skip this? Yep, I can. Oh, no. <laughs> I skipped it, then did it again. Yeah, so I can come back here and uh, possibly do that mission again uh, once I've got the other uh, villain. But I won't be able to do it now. Uh, but I reckon I'm going to be having to, to plant all of these acorns. And are they going to grow? Oh, I get some... I get some big vegetables. I'm not entirely sure what vegetable that's supposed to be. And oh, actually, oh, look at this. Look at this. A little sneaky hidden area down here. Oh, look, I found the uh, the legendary treasure. Is this some sort of rocket hat? Uh, it's also a windmill hat. <laughs> I found myself uh, my very own windmill hat. Not too shabby. And there's uh, some money down here as well. And why are these... These rocks are really shiny for some reason. I don't know if there's any uh, magic in them. Uh, there probably is. There seems to be magic absolutely everywhere <laughs> inside of a Skylanders. Right, though. I reckon I've got to be growing all of these. Oh, look. If I break them open, I get money. And then is it going to grow again? I'm not entirely sure. I, kn I know I'm going to need to grow them for some reason, but I'm not entirely sure why. Let's just go and plant them all and uh, see uh, if anything uh, does actually um, happen. Maybe I'm just supposed to be doing it uh, to try and get the uh, the money from them, maybe. Well, let's go and uh, plant all of them and to see if anything happens. And then if it doesn't, I'm just going to break them all open and get the uh, the money from the uh, the inside anyway. Because look, I've already got 3,000 uh, monies uh, for Kaboom. And uh, when I started, I think he had about 400. And so, yeah, I am doing uh, really well. Hint, plant seeds in whole. I was already doing that. And it does seem like I am getting more money from them. Because even when I plant them and then they get destroyed, um, you can still see that they're still kind of planted. You can still see the, uh, the leaves down there. So... Um, yeah, it doesn't look like anything's actually happening. Uh, so let's destroy them all and go and uh, grab all the uh, the money uh, because they're gold coins as well. So they're uh, they're pretty valuable. So let's go and uh, break all of these open. And I think this was literally uh, just to, to get the money. And I am not one to moan. And oh no, I'm sorry, sheep. I accidentally just uh, shot the creep. <laughs> uh, the uh, the sheep in the background. Well, the sheep creep they're called, aren't they? Anyway, I need uh, one more mech to find. Uh, so let's go and try and track it down. I'm of course uh, also looking for. Uh, any uh, hidden areas or anything uh, around here to see if I can get uh, all of the uh, the bonus things. Always good fun. And it looks like I found the uh, the stew house. And I am now proceeding to destroy everything that was inside said stew house. <laughs> and oh look, oh look, there's the um, there's the last mech. But they seem, for some reason, to be trying to cook the mech. So am um, I gonna have to try and cool it down before I can get it? Um, Okay, let's speak to this person and find out why he's trying to cook this mech. <laughs> I'm sure he's got a, a good reason, but I just don't know yet. Oh, uh, look, man, I use this mech piece for everything. Cooking, laundry, baths, so if you really want it, I need you to throw some treasure my way, something. Oh, uh, that's not, I would have to pay for it. Okay, well, I guess I do need it. Oh, it's only 20 gold. I got more gold than that from destroying all of his furniture. <laughs> he should have just smashed up a few pots. He would have got the money himself. All right, well, then a deal has been struck. May the spirit of mech parts be with you always. Yeah. The spirit of mech parts. Sure. Right, there we go, though. I now have all three pieces of the uh, the mech, so I should now uh, hopefully be able to, to piece them together uh, to make big one. Uh, one big one. I don't know whether I need to um to give them to someone and they build them together. Oh, there we go. It. You found all the parts we need to rebuild our mech forces and defend this town. And don't worry, I saved this blue one just for you. <laughs> Hop in! Woohoo! I guess I got my mech. Where did we get all the, the other mechs from? <laughs> now I'll just lead the other trolls to the outskirts of town and into battle. <laughs> I should warn you though, they're not the best fighters. Um, okay, that's alright though. How did I fit inside of this mech? I'm pretty much bigger than the mech. <laughs> this is going to be pretty cool though. And look, these are the, uh, the Mabu. 
And I guess because it's the opposite, uh, the Mabu can actually fight now, where the Mabu used to be pretty rubbish before. And it looks like, um, have I got like a, a lightning weapon? It looks like I'm using a, a lightning weapon uh, to destroy everything. And uh, I haven't even explored all of the, the area around here yet, but it looks like uh, we're we're moving forward. We're moving into battle. This is quite cool, actually. Uh, they got a, another line of uh, defense here, though. Uh, so let's go and uh, try and take out uh, all of these uh, now evil Mabu. This seems weird because I spent the entire game protecting and looking after and fighting alongside the Mabu. And uh, now I'm going well, after them well, all. Well, well, well. It seems those peace-loving, tree-hugging, cabbage-kissing trolls are actually trying to fight back. Imagine the nerve. <laughs> Time to show you guys why my catchphrase is do. <laughs> it's weird seeing evil Flynn. And your catchphrase isn't isn't doom, it's boom. Right, here we go. I nearly started uh, attacking these uh, goblins. It's uh, taking a while, these trolls, sorry. It's taking a while for me to, to get used to them being uh, on my side. And oh, there's a, an elemental gate up here. I might actually uh, have a go going through here. Let me go and uh, switch over to, to Bushwhack and uh, we can go through the uh, the elemental gate and uh, see if we can get a new hat. Maybe a new hat to make the boom go even faster would be <laughs> particularly handy. He's so unbelievably strong in every way, but just so slow. Just so, so slow. <laughs> right, so let's go through uh, uh, the lazy look at them. Let's go through as a uh, bushwhack as well, because I've not played as bushwhack for too much. Uh, it looks like the uh, the uh, hat is right up the uh, the top here anyway. So let's go uh, grab a little bit of the money and uh, let's go switch back over to, to Kaboom. I right, so we can put the uh, the hat straight on his head. Uh, I'm only going to put it on uh, if it's actually uh, putting his speed up. Uh, because if it's not, then uh, I'm going to stay with the uh, the shower cap on. One, because it looks very fetching on him. And also because I want him to go as fast as possible. So now I need to... Mash, 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 potato. And ooh, oh, a lovely fruit basket. What's it called? It's called a conocopia hat. Corner, cornucopia hat. <laughs> and it uh, gives the uh, the speed up a little bit and a lot more elemental power. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm going to stay with my uh, my good old-fashioned shower cap just because it looks so lovely. And are these, these are little, little chompies down here. Why are the chompies still evil when the uh, the Mabu and then the um, uh, the trolls as well, they all switched around, I'm you see? I'm going to blow you up so bad. Aha! Mablobs. Mablobs. This is the, uh, the guy that I needed. Oh, he's gone. He's, got, he's running away. He's running away. <laughs> right, let's go and uh, try and chase after him if we can. Uh, let's go and try and push forward. There seems to be Mabu all over the place. And let's try using uh, a few more of my special moves. You can see I can use the mortar. I set targets on the ground. And then he goes and try and, uh, tries to, to take them out. Let's go and try and shoot this guy. I should probably just shoot this guy rather than firing mortars. This isn't really helping me. He's just hurting me. <laughs> I think the, uh, the mortars uh, is definitely uh, a weapon. Uh, you want to do from when they're they're really far away from you. It doesn't seem uh, to be as effective uh, when you're right up next to them. But look, I got a um uh, another story scroll. One day, one day I will actually read one of these uh, story scrolls. <laughs> I'm saving them all up. I've got absolutely loads of them. Just never read any of them. I don't even know what they're, what they're about. I don't know if they're a story about me. I don't know if they're a story about chaos or or whatnot. But anyway, there's a bunch of gold coins here. Came out the radio. And uh, let's keep heading this way. I've actually got a, uh, a villain. And I did say that villains uh, are stronger at the moment. So I think what I could do, a good thing to do uh, when you're playing as a, a really slow Skylander, is to um, uh, switch to your villain uh, when moving around. And then when you get into a fight, uh, you can go and uh, switch back. Uh, to your Skylander, and then that way you don't have to worry about going around slow everywhere. Uh, you can go around quickly, and then when you get to fighting, you can switch to the stronger Skylander. Or right, let's try and do a better job at this mortar then, shall we? Oh no, they're too far away. But they're just out of reach. If I just fire them there, and then move forward. Oh, there we go. Look how strong it is. It still managed to, to hurt them anyway. Right, let's just pretty much fire them on my head, and that should uh, take out that guy. Uh, luckily, it uh, seems like uh, I'm not actually able to, to hurt myself with them, which is very lucky, <laughs> because I would have done... Uh, just that then and whoa look at this i made a huge hole in the the mountain and now i can for the third time in this video potato go and get myself a whole load of extra jewels and yeah let's go and push forward and try and take out more of the uh the mabu then shall we so as i said i'm going to switch over to uh it's a rage mage as the other villain i have at the moment although it looks like i'm going to be catching a new one soon and yeah then i can push forward quickly and oh it looks like i'm going to be uh getting another another uh mech back as well so i can 
uh, push forward uh, using that. But before that, I can go and get my health up uh, on this melon and uh, go and have a little bit of a, a wander around here just to see if there are any more bonuses. Nope, just a, a big pile of money. Anyway, I'm going to carry on pushing forward and fighting with the uh, the trolls by my side. Uh, but unfortunately, I'm going to be doing that in the, uh, the next episode rather than here because we have uh, just about run out of time. Uh, so yeah, I'll be uploading my next episode of Skylanders as soon as I very well can. And there'll be a link to that in the description once it is uh, online. And uh, in that episode, I will be playing as a brand new character. So make sure uh, you come back and check that out. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later.